And welcome back everyone, welcome back to Final Fantasy 15. Got a bit more time to record tonight, good, maybe get at least another three videos recorded, so without any further ado, let's move on with some other game. Now, I kind of feel like I just rushed through here to get to the, you know, Haven. Though I think I interacted with, interacted with everything I needed Don't to interact with. Oh shush Gladio. Get your head out of your butt for a minute. I got seriously look how slow he's going. I am not taking my time like that. Nope. No sorry. I got some fights to do, have we? God. Oh. Feels oh. <laughs> That's it. Feels so good to be fighting. I've been away from the game for well about a day and a half maybe. Oh, I like that. It's like a counter attack. Wait for it. Yeah. Just after you phase through an, an attack. Like, I'll do it now. Oh, because mine's going to be parry first. So, hold on. Let me explain what I mean. If I phase and then press circle straight after, it's kind of like a counter attack. Let's see if I can do it again. See? Come on, get me. Come and get me. Boom! All three knocked on the ground, look. Glad that's over. I only wish I could do more. You staying alive is enough. I'm just getting really into Good. Oh, that takes care of the cool. key. And the generators? Apparently they're back by the control panel. Then let's go. Yeah, I love this music in this game. Just, just seems. I mean, all the battle musics on this game are just brilliant. I honestly, I love them. I don't know their names by, you know, soundtrack name. So I can't tell you which ones I really like. But honestly, I love the majority so of them. Sticking together. Oh. Gladio, seriously dude, get your head out of your butt for a minute. Prompt us back there, you can continue to escort him. Alright, another fight. Oh, I'm going to town on him. Go on. Oh, nice. Oh, oh, it's just so cool. It's just so nice to... I don't know, it just feels so... What's the word? Like, hyped up, maybe? It makes you feel so good when you're fighting to a music like this. Bum, bum. Seems to be doing pretty well with the uh, phasing and dodging. Come on then, if you dare. Gladiolus. Oh, four nines. Wow. Okay, we can go. What did you expect? Okay, we can go this way. Hey, knocked. Wait up. It's all right, man. I'm just exploring. Splendid building stone. That's something I, d I actually don't know what that is. Um, I don't know where I'm going now. I was about trying to jump off a cliff or something. Right? Yeah. right. Okay. The hand of the king. Fire up the backup generators. Oh, what the frick was that? What is that? Ah, it's a gigant, a gigant toad or, or, or whatever. Oh, I can't climb up there really. Yeah. Yeah. Work the machine, that thing in the way. 
Then we take it out. Come on. Boink. Oh. Oh, told you using that gun. The uh, Biblio Blaster, I think it is. Line side. Oh, look at the damage. Well, that is why blind side's important. Prompto used a death blow. Nice. Gigant, gigant toad uh, stakes. I think we just picked up there. Where is it? Right here. How does it look? She's wired and ready. Give it a go. And Come don't on. blow it up. Oh, thanks for the advice. Thank you for the cutscene. Did it work? Yep. One more to go. Sweet. All right. Uh, I want to climb up first, even though it's not the way to go. Oh, okay. We climbed up. The van doesn't say I want to climb up, even though I know it's not the way to go. We have to climb down. There it is, the generator. We've got the power. Might not have it for long, though. Hurry up and move the machine. Yes, sir. Nice. Don't know if I can go this way. All right. Well. Going it alone, huh? Oh. Oh, wow. Get back. <laughs> wow. Potion time. Can't keep version for uh, every attack. Oh, Gladio's moving pretty OP. Look, four nines. What? I let you down. Oh, nice. Fabulous. Gonna wait for your move. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Two point oh. Fabulous gonna take it down. Four mines. Oh, wow. He hit both of them at the same time. I think I don't know that. Oh, God, I can't stand this tension between Gladio and Noctis. Seriously, dudes. Brother in arms and all that. Okay, so now we can go in. Hopefully. Did you hear that? Sounds like we're clear. Grand. Then let's move. <laughs> Grand. Don't run too far ahead. Oh. Don't run ahead. Oh, shit, you. Gladio, you can be a right douche sometimes. Uh, is it down here? Yeah. <laughs> Hold up. You sure you're ready for this? You got what it takes? To do what? To face your ancestors and convince them to lend you their strength. Got a long road ahead. Can you see this through? To the end? Sure resolve. This is unknown territory for me now, by the way, guys. So this is going to be rather interesting for me. And maybe hopefully for you as well. 
can and will. Whether I like it or not, I've got a duty to fulfill. As king. <laughs> You're damn right you do. Then that means you'd better start taking this seriously. Okay, interesting. Now roused, not aroused. Noctis vitality is increased by 50%. Okay. Good to go. <laughs> we did it! Together! Hold your chocobos, Highness. This cave is huge! The tomb's further in? You wanna wait here? Alone. Here. Not what I said. <laughs> oh man, something stinks around here. Don't slip and fall in whatever that is. Search the royal tomb. Ah, some of them again. Let's get some magic in the fray. Quint cast. Cast magic five times, is it? Yeah. Five times. That's mental. Let's do make some other magic. Because it was quite a fair bit stronger than than the other magic set we've got. Hmm, not that one. Oh wow, 191 potency. Quint cast. Yeah, three of the spells in the five chain is level 99. Jeebus. Let's have a look what else we can get. Nothing else there. Just <laughs> um, having a quick look at what else we can make. That might be pretty cool. Yeah, we'll go with that. Sweet peppers. <clears throat> there we go. Nice. Quip. I'm going to save the Quint cast for a boss, maybe. Come on. Gather together. Get back. Gladio. Gladio. Sorry to break this up. Wow, he is so OP at the moment. There we go, blind side attack. I didn't mean to press out, sorry. Hey. Trying to get blindsided on them if you can tell, there we go. Boom. <laughs> Another blindside. Come on, blindside it. There we go, blindside them. Oh, glad they'll finish him off. Sorry to break this up. Boo. That is an awesome move. <laughs> Prompto, that gun looks badass. <laughs> Let us make haste. So a quick little scan around, see what there is around here. 
Don't run ahead. Oh, shush, Gladio. What's the worst that's gonna happen, eh? <clears throat> ah, I was hoping we can go behind there to find a hidden item. Hidden item. Just getting the outline of the map so far for now. Yeah. this I hate eggs do we really want to know what's back there <laughs> that looks like a mouth is that oh face? my god what is it I'm so real bad um The hell? What? Wow. Wow. It's healing itself. What do we do? This must be a good time for There must be a way. Mad Brow's gone berserk. Keep our distance of what is Mad Brow. Whoa! Look who's hatching! Bust them up! Wow. <laughs> well, apparently I'm not okay, but the rest of the guys aren't. Knocked. I have an idea. If I may. <laughs> ah, as I suspected. It really worked. Nice one, Iggy. Now, we have a fighting chance. Ignis has rejoined the fray. Obtained technique Libre Elementia. Alright, okay. Yeah, well. Okay, time to get this uh, magic that I've been talking about. It's probably not going to be that powerful, but... Awesome music, though. Is it dead? It is! And it's all thanks to Iggy. Iggy. Saved us. <sighs> Seriously. We'd be plant food if it weren't for you. Happy to help. What, no royal commendation from his majesty? None for you, at least. <clears throat> well, that was awesome. <laughs> I enjoyed that. I know I kind of one-shot it at the beginning. I mean, in fact, I got, I got AP for casting magic, which is pretty damn awesome anyway. But that was brilliant. I absolutely loved that. And I loved to see Malbra. And I loved the whole idea of the bad breath thing. That was mint. I kind of wish quickly I'd gone to my gear. And gone to... I think is it? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's that's what he uses now. Libra Elementia. Scan for an enemy's weakness and exploit it with an element, elemental attack. Tech bar, tech bar by one. Brilliant. Oh, that was awesome. I really, really enjoyed that. Remember, this is the first time I'm seeing any of this now. I'm kind of semi gutted that I'd played the game up until this part on my own anyway, but oh, I admit, I really enjoyed that. Whisking them just makes a mess. Better fry them. What's he talking about? Oh, eggs. I think we found it. Just wish they found a better place to build it. That music as well for that boss fight is just so epic. I love like the, uh, I think it's called Melconic. I think it's called Melconic. 
type of soundtrack. Ugh. I should have known actually, with a, with a floor like this, or should I say, the, you know, the ground like this flooded, there was going to be a Marlboro, wasn't it? So awesome that it was actually implemented, that bad breath. Oh, it was so cool. I'm easily pleased, but that, that pleased me greatly. Katan yes. of the Warrior. That's awesome. A moment. Is everything okay? It bloody well isn't. And I won't suffer this pointless bickering in silence any longer. <sighs> Let's be frank. My vision hasn't improved, and probably won't. Yet in spite of this, I would remain with you all. To the very end. <laughs> Sorry, but I object. War is a matter of life and death. But we'll be there! It's not about us looking out for him! Uh-huh. Well, then he should be free to choose. There's more to it than just what he wants. I know full well! I won't ask you to slow down. If I cannot keep up, I will bow out. <sighs> What says his majesty? Noct. You are king. One cannot lead by standing still. A king pushes onward, always, accepting the consequences and never looking back. Gladio, Noct will take his rightful place, but only once he's ready. Have it your way. We're still taking a big risk. We better all be ready. <sighs> Return directly to the station? I think we're done in here. I could be wrong now, probably. But I'm gonna go with return. That was a really, really tough scene that. Really have a lot more respect for Ignis now. That was pretty damn awesome, that speech. And Gladio's attitude at the moment. I mean, I know he's frustrated, you know, he wants he wants to do the best for Noctis. But man, he's been I feel like he's been a bit too harsh. And you know, though Noctis has just lost his can't really say it was the love of his life, but his love interest anyway. I feel like maybe Gladio might be being a bit harsh. Maybe. But then again, I'm a, I'm a bit I'm a bit of a softy myself. Do you guys so. mind if we stop in Tenebrae? Eh, might as well hop off. If it helps him move on. If it helps him move on. Well, oh, that's, that's a bit harsh. Wow, look at us all. It's like three brothers and there's like this huge tension between these three at the moment. Just Gladio, dude, you need to you need to chillax, man. Time to get our journey back on track. Next stop, Tenebrae. I mean I feel like he's been so harsh at the moment. I'm I'm almost almost shall I say on the verge of disliking Gladio because he's being a bit harsh. Don't get me wrong though, he's a badass character, badass, you know, player. But I don't know, just I feel he's being a bit too harsh. Um, <laughs> I will. I think I'm done here. I'm just thinking, that, am I done or not? Um, okay. What's on your minds? New outposts have been marked on your map. Nearby danger zones have been marked on your map. That's an interesting one. Uh, Take a look at eat. the menu. 500 kill, maximum HP by 500. 
I'm just gonna buy this because okay. it's cheap. Saying that, I've got no gill. I really should spend at least a video or two doing some side quests and some more hunts. Hunts, remember, give good gill, and it's not you're not doing it for the EXP. Am I gonna level up here? No. That's good. We'll see you around. Alrighty. High Commander Florey has been deemed accountable for Altitia's tragedy and sentenced to execution. Lord Ravis Knox Florey was promoted to the Imperial Army's top post amid the turmoil of the failed peace talks. The High Commander's primary responsibility was restoring stability to Lucis, yet his campaign against the Hydrian ended in disaster, incurring monumental losses for the Empire and collateral damage to the area. In the wake of the Tide Mother's wrath, the government of Accordo has declared a state of national emergency. On behalf of the nation, I would like to express our relief that King Yeah, we we uh, we heard all that before, I think. Okay, so let's move on with some more of the game. Yeah, nothing else to pick up, so let's all move set on. for boarding. You cannot return after departure ever again. Yeah, well, let's roll. In that case, hop aboard. We'll be leaving shortly. We're here for you. Yeah, let us help you. And we're off! Are we clear? Crystal. Hey, watch your step. You're not pushing onward? Not at his expense. Fair enough. Does make me wonder at the moment <clears throat> if um, Ignis is actually going to get his eyesight back. I'm hoping he does, because otherwise it's going to be a long game without without Ignis fighting and helping us. Level thirty nine, level thirty eight. I think the storyline's caught up with us a fair bit now. Uh, that would have been quite cool if it didn't look like we were just all posing and playing Twister. Fairly cool, boring, not that good, meh. Nah. Kind of cool. Ah, oh, no, they're just depressing pictures really out there. But I feel like I need one picture of um, Ignis as he's blind. We'll go with that one. I don't know if you're going to get like a compilation at the end. Where it'll show all of your pictures throughout the game or something. Alright, so chapter 11, In the Dark. Ignis resolves... Ign Ignis's resolve forces a reconciliation between Noctis and Gladiolus and restores harmony to the group. With renewed vigour, the four friends reboard the train and head for Tenebrae. Home of the late Lady Luna Freya. This is going to be rather interesting. Chapter 11 as well. I know there was loads of updates with chapter 13. Now what was actually in chapter 13, or originally in 13, I actually don't honestly know. But whatever changes there were made, I heard there was some additional cutscenes added here and there, so... In case people haven't seen them, I'm kind of looking forward to that. I'm, whatever they've done, basically, I'm hoping I'm hoping it's going to be pretty cool. Anyway, so... And then, of course, we've got the Gladiolus DLC, which Feels I cannot good wait to, to ride do the well. rails. Sure does. Eager to drive once we're in Gralia. <laughs> if they'll let me. <laughs> we're fortunate to have the Regalia at all. We owe the First Secretary our thanks. She'd get more thanks if she gave us a discount. Those transceivers are top-notch. I recall when the Hydrian raged. In the midst of the Empire's retreat, one conspicuous craft remained behind. The Chancellor's. The last thing I remember seeing was his ship heading for the altar. I fell unconscious and was powerless to stop him. I'm just glad you're alive. Oh, is someone else there? Gladio, he just came back. Where did he go anyway? On a brief reconnaissance, something caught my ear. Hey, Captain. 
Mission complete. Splendid. So what caught your ear? Rumors of longer nights. They've been growing longer day by day. There was talk of it back in Lucis, but recent days have shown an unseasonably sharp change. Huh. Should this trend continue, before long, there won't be daylight. Well, it's not out of the question. The Empire has already slain half of the Six. No wonder the whole world's in disarray. I guess. And longer nights mean more demons. Seen that with our own eyes. I happen to overhear a fellow passenger discussing this very same phenomenon. So he sent yours truly to seek him out. Nice police work. Well, don't want to keep him waiting. No, we don't. Back in a moment. Sure. I bet Adin appears now. I'm just betting. Whoa! Oh, there you are, buddy. Did you see this? Oh, it's unreal. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting little conversation. So the nights are getting longer. Never seen anything like it. Doesn't make any sense. Oh. <laughs> What's going on? It's a real mystery. I'm not liking that snow cloud. Kind of gives me the chills. Like, who comes up with this stuff? I couldn't dream something like this if I tried. It's a wondrous world. 